Hi, I'm Dr. Jory Simpson. I'm a surgical oncologist at Toronto Dermatology Centre and at St. Michael's Hospital. My practice is in breast cancer and skin cancer and I'm the Chief of General Surgery at St. Michael's Hospital. I'm also very involved in the University of Toronto Medical School and I'm the Director of Surgery within the Medical School. I also am quite active doing research in oncology and surgical education. So genetic testing is a test that actually analyzes one's DNA to see if they inherited a risk factor or a predisposition for developing a certain type of cancer. So the ideal person who would benefit from genetic testing would be somebody that has a significant family history of malignancies, of cancer, either on their maternal side, on their mom's side, or on their paternal side, on their dad's side. More often than not, you see individuals that have cancer scattered throughout their family on both sides, and these individuals as well would benefit from having genetic testing. So it's actually very simple how it's performed. It's a simple saliva test, which is done in the office after a consultation with myself in which we sit down, we discuss your entire family history, we discuss other proactive measures that you can take, like screening programs, and then after that, genetic testing is done through a saliva test. So what we do is we test for over 60 genes that predispose somebody to cancer. And these cancers can be anywhere in someone's body, everything from brain cancer to skin cancer to cancer in one's abdomen to breast cancer, uterine cancer. And so it's a very comprehensive list of malignancies that we're testing for. It's actually incredibly fast how quickly we can get results. Within a couple of weeks, we'll have results. So if somebody tested positive for a cancer gene, what would happen is we would sit down and we would discuss your individual risk profile and in particular what type of cancers you're at risk for. We'd then develop a very specific screening program in consultation with a genetic counsellor and we would discuss ways to prevent the malignancies that you're predisposed to from manifesting themselves.